Hello, I'm Elena Clark, Assistant Director at the Cybersecurity and Infrastructure Security Agency, or CISA. Welcome back to the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services and CISA's Cybersecurity Awareness Month campaign for the healthcare and public health sector. Today, we are continuing our discussion about critical cybersecurity behaviors that every organization should employ to keep their organization and patients safe from cyber threats. It's critical to recognize and report phishing attempts. Phishing emails, texts, and calls are the top methods of data compromise in the HPH sector. If you've ever seen a link that looks a little off or an email that asks for your personal information, it's likely a phishing scheme. Everyone in an organization should be cautious of unsolicited emails, texts, or calls asking for personal information, as these tend to be red flags. Always avoid sharing sensitive information or credentials over the phone or email, unless you are confident of the contact and is absolutely necessary. And don't click on links or open attachments sent from unknown sources. It is always best to verify the authenticity of requests by contacting the individual or organization through a trusted channel. Most importantly, if you come across an email you think is suspicious, report it to the appropriate person in your organization to ensure others are made aware of the phishing attempt. Over to HHS to discuss the last critical cybersecurity behavior. Hi, I'm Brian Mazanek, Deputy Director of the Office of Preparedness at the Administration for Strategic Preparedness and Response, or ASPR which coordinates HHS's efforts to help healthcare organizations prepare for and respond to cyber threats. The last critical cybersecurity behavior we're going to discuss is using strong passwords or a password phrase. Strong passwords are critical to protect data and keep patients safe. Passwords should be at least 16 characters long, randomly generated, unique, and include all four character types, uppercase, lowercase numbers, and symbols. For more information on recognizing and reporting phishing, check out HHS resources such as the 405D program's Knowledge on Demand training platform at 405d.hhs.gov slash knowledge on demand. Also, the Health Industry Cybersecurity Practices publication can be your guide on the importance of password policies in your organization and jumpstart your efforts to protect patients from cyber threats. At CISA, we're committed to helping healthcare organizations build better cyber hygiene behaviors. Everyone in an organization has a role to play when battling cybersecurity threats. Therefore, it is important for everyone to ensure they can spot phishing attempts and that they use strong passwords to protect their data. We encourage you to share these critical cybersecurity behaviors with your coworkers and always remember that in most cases, you are the first line of defense for your organization. Tune in next week as we close out Cybersecurity Awareness Month. Produced by the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services.